Hello and welcome to the Motorcycle Report. My name is Ryan, and if you're like me, you want to know all there is to know about the past, present, and future of the motorcycle world. And today we're going to talk about the past, and that is the Yonkers Motorcycle Club. They were the first motorcycle club ever created in the United States, and you might as well say created in the world. Let's go to the Wikipedia page and I'll read about them and then we'll go look at their website. The Yonkers Motorcycle Club originally started as the Yonkers Bicycle Club and was founded on November 19, 1879. The Yonkers Motorcycle Club was formed in 1903 in Yonkers, New York by President George Usko Ellis. George Ellis was married January 25, 1916 to Miss Lois Smith of Yonkers. George Usko Ellis was appointed State Commissioner of New York of the Federation of American Motorcyclists in August 1915. The Yonkers Motorcycle Club served as a civil defense messenger service during the earlier part of the 1900s, delivering messages to various government officials throughout the country. An article taken from the Boston Daily Globe, March 11, 1921, titled Cyclists Return After Call on Vice President, describes the journey that George A. Ellis and Henry E. Andrews made when they left Boston on a Sunday morning at 9 o'clock a.m., bearing a message from Governor Cox to Vice President Coolidge. They completed their first lake of the journey, a distance of 510 miles, in 22 hours and 45 minutes, arriving in Washington Monday morning. They left Washington at 8 o'clock Tuesday morning and stopped at Ellis's home in Yonkers en route to Boston. Since 1927, the club has been chartered by the American Motorcyclists Association. The Yonkers Motorcycle Club is the oldest active motorcycle club in the world. All right, and you can see their shield over on the right side with their uh, the Yonkers MCNY. Looks like the back of a leather jacket in some ways. All right, let's go right to their website. So even back then, they were doing things that uh, were very helpful to our civilization, like message couriers. Um, you know, I wouldn't really call them the Pony Express, but uh, they were... Uh, known to be very helpful as far as uh, delivering messages and I'm sure in many other ways. So at the, on their website uh, we've got up front here the uh, the shield across the top. You can see their uh, the symbol of their club and then what pops up first is they have a Christmas party coming up this year and it's 2018 presently. And so on Saturday, December 1st, they have a Christmas party. Looks like that'll be fun. So if we go to uh, History of Yonkers Motorcycle Club, click on that. They give you a good description of how the club started and how it's lasted as long as it has. So let's, uh, let's read an excerpt from that, and I'll read this paragraph here. This one, the last one on the list. When the American Motorcyclist Association was founded in 1927, the Yonkers Motorcycle Club was given the charter number six and, and October 3rd, 1952, the club was incorporated in New York State. Back in World War II, the Yonkers Motorcycle Club was the second motorcycle club in the United States to serve as a civil defense messenger and unit in the city of Yonkers, and right now we are currently looking for bin Laden. Okay, I made up the bin Laden thing. Just wanted to see if you're all paying attention. So <laughs> whoever wrote this uh, member of the club or the club and uh, collectively uh, made, it, made it fun. This whole history of their club is, is a lot of fun to read. I'll let you read it yourself. So we go down here and we look at the uh, newspaper clipping from 100 years of motorcycling. I imagine that was printed in uh, 2003. And 100 years. Look at that. 
Well, they've been around for a while. All right, so they have different things to click on here on the left side. Uh, a memory of fallen brothers, where they have pictures of um, the the brothers, the writing brothers that have have uh, passed on. Uh, very respectful page there, and some nice uh, photographs under the YMC 1916 and past, back in the day. Nice pictures there. Let's click on that real quick. We have some some guys standing on the. On the sidewalk there, looks like some newspaper clippings. And so let's look at the breakout run. Some different pictures. Doing some, some running, some rallying, I imagine. All right, the Roaring 80s. Billy Arthur run. Joe Cool Run, Weather, Yonkers Support Gear. Let's click on that. And you can get your own Support Yonkers Motorcycle Club t-shirt. I'm thinking about getting one. Looks like a cool uh, shirt to wear. You got the classic old looking Harley type motorcycle here. You can get on their mailing list if you'd want to uh, have them send you updates on their activities. And from the website, I don't I, I uh, don't get an immediate upfront uh, perspective of, of everything that they're doing. I'm sure they're doing more than everything I'm seeing here. They do have a calendar of events. Uh, they seem to do uh, something every month, and I'm not sure how wide-reaching the club is since it's uh, um, kind of a local Yonkers club I think it's it's not a country perhaps not a country-wide uh, club so um, if you're not living in the Yonkers area then maybe it's not going to be uh, uh, advantageous for you to be a part of it just because you're not um, in amongst the activities there but uh, it's it's very, they're very notable. I mean, they've been around, for, uh, like I said, the, the first club ever. And so I didn't want to go on and, and talk about motorcycle clubs without mentioning the Yonkers Motorcycle Club. And they've, they do have some lots of pictures on here to look at. We'll go to the 1980s. Some different photographs of, of, uh, of things. And and check out that uh, engine plate isn't that nicely done anyway that ends this report if you like this video and you'd like to see more please click the subscribe button thank you and i'll talk to you soon